When you are working with time-based data, such as dates and hours, you can apply query filters to restrict the results to the desired values. In this tutorial, you will apply a query filter to restrict results to a specific date range. Note that this tutorial covers features available in SAP Crystal Reports for Enterprise, version 14.0.0, build R760 v2010-1019. To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. This report displays the hire dates for the employees of a company. Insert a query filter, so that the report displays only the records for employees whose hire dates were between the first hire date in 1992, and the last hire date in 1993. Click Edit Query. Click Plus to expand the Employee folder. Drag the hire date object to the Query Filters pane. Click Hire Date to drag the object. Click in the Query Filters pane to drop the object. Define the Query Filter to return results within the date range. Click the Operator list. Select Between. You must now define the beginning and ending of the period you want to include in the report. Notice that calendar icons are available, enabling you to select the dates using a calendar interface. Click Calendar. Since you are interested in dates from 1992 and 1993, it is easier to specify the desired date range using the LOV, rather than the calendar. Click Cancel. Click the operand list. Select LOV. Select the first date in 1992 as the beginning of the time range you want to include, in the report. Select March 30, 1992, 12 a.m. Click Add. Click OK. Define the ending date for the time range to include in the report. Click the operand list. Select LOV. Select the last date in 1993 as the end of the time period to include in the report. Click October 12, 1993, 12 a.m. Click Add. Click OK. Click OK. The report refreshes and returns the list of employees hired within the specified date range. You have successfully applied a time-based query filter. This is the end of the tutorial.